we are conditioning ourselves for the next asan class stand tall smile broad both the palms at the center of the chest chin parallel to the ground slowly close your eyes and watch your breath हम अपने मन को हमेशा संतुलित रखना है इसी में ही हमारा आत्म विकास समाया है हम अपने मन को हमेशा संतुलित रखना है इसी में ही हमारा आत्म विकास समाया है आत्म विकास समाया है आत्म विकास समाया है हरिओम तत्सत जय गुरुदेव Good morning everybody namaste suprabhat good morning good morning how is your energy level good so take a place <clears throat> let's start with the shoulder rotations turn it around hands in front lock your fingers stretch your arms in front good other way around change other way around and relax okay take your hands by side <coughs> palm up palm down up down up down clockwise rotate clockwise your palms other way around and slowly start flying higher higher and relax okay turn your head to the right <coughs> center left center right center left center drop your head to the right center left center right center left center now rotate your head clockwise other way around and relax okay hip rotations take the hands on your hip slowly rotate your hips a 
other way around chain other way around and relax feet together fold your knees press your palms on your knees rotate other way around change and relax lift your leg up slowly flex your toe down take it up <coughs> down up down up sideways excellent clockwise other way around Lift your knee up a little bit. Rotate your toe. Perfect. Other way around. Relax. We change the same other side. <coughs> up and down toe. And then sideways. Rotate clockwise. Other way around. <clears throat> knee up in the good other way around and relax okay ready so we start with ek padasan <clears throat> slowly lift your toe on your opposite thigh If you are comfortable, slowly take your arms up to your side. Slowly. Back. Chain. Shasan. Today we'll do Baddha. So slowly. Today we are going to do the Hastavada Angushtasan series, so it will help you. So arm up. Be focus. Release. Other side. perfect baddha release relax natrajasan Good. 
really Pawan Muktasan standing slowly lift your leg squeeze it hard flex the toe down this will help you for your hastabad angushtasan variation so the higher the knee the toe will go higher when you start with the hastapad angushtasan series release other side final position the back should be straight chin up toe down flexing release side variation <clears throat> good once you get the hold again keep your back straight Today we'll do the sandal variation. Asta Padma Mushtasan. Perfect. Then slowly, once you get the hold, excellent. Hold the leg and slowly release your fingers. Same thing with other side. Good. get the hold of the fingers and then slowly extend your leg up perfect hold the leg and relax comfortable ready for garudasan <clears throat> should be overlapped the both the palms should be in front of the face ideal position of garudasan it depends upon the mobility of your joints release sideways अर्धोत्कटासन परफेक्ट इन दिस वेरिएशन ऑफ उत्कटासन अर्ध द प्रेशर शुडेंट कम ऑन द नी इट शुड कम ऑन द थाई सो हैव टू एडजस्ट योर अपर बॉडी एंगल अकॉर्डिंगली चेंज catch your breath ready for the hastapad angushtasan series standing okay so first we'll do three variations of hastapad angushtasan standing okay so slowly lift your toe 
hold it and stretch it out here you focus either knee on the either knee there it should be straight in initial stages and then slowly start extending and then start pulling it up release other side Face that side, so the, come to know the position of the back. So slowly lift your toe, hold it, stretch it. Excellent. If you are comfortable, start pulling your leg higher. Good. Release. Other side. Final position. The back should be straight, but it depends upon the flexibility. As your hamstrings open, muscles open, then only the final position you will have. You know, release. Now side variation. other side perfect breathe normal release cross variation <laughs> right to left palm get to hold change release one more round this time we'll twist half side with no problem okay hold it opposite Slowly take the hand out. Excellent. Focus. Release. Change. <clears throat> Slowly. Actually, we skip the warm up. That's what is happening. We'll do that now. Okay. <laughs> Basically, if you want to improve your Hastavada Angushtasana, the warm-up is, you know, take the side with now. Yeah. Okay, take a comfortable distance. Yes. Take more distance. You'll be more comfortable. That's perfect. Good. Good. This really opens up your body, okay? Relax. 
finished relax relax okay so the konasan 3 hastapada angushtasan okay so take the hand in front you are touching the palm to the toe so it is hastapada angushtasan so it becomes the variations of hastapada angushtasan so both the hands in front palm facing upward eyes focus very slowly take your arms out look at your right palm right palm will go to the left toe hasta pada angushta look up good now take the head in the center of the body and if you can lower your body but keep touching then only it will be hasta pada angushta hasta pada angushta look down at your right palm and slowly come back turn your head look at your left palm and take the left palm left heart hasta pada angushta hold the toe take the head in the center of the body if your body allows you lower your body down and then look up and stay there this is also excellent warm up for your hasta pada angushta asan series look down at your left palm slowly come back look in front and take your hands down one more round hasta pad angushtasan start look at your right palm take it to your left toe touch the toe take the head in the center of the body if your body allows you lower your body down and stay there feel the weight on the toes breathe normal let the body open especially hamstrings back left right touch take the head in the center slowly look up at your palm feel the weight on the toe look down lift your palm and slowly come back and take the hands down okay there is one variation of the hastapada angushtasan we call it trikonasan stand sideways again if you slowly lower your body down touch your palms to the toe feel the weight on the toe keep looking up what is this hasta pad angushtasan slowly take your hands at shoulder one more round slowly hands at shoulder push your body forward slowly lower your hands down touch your fingertips to the toe hasta pad feel the weight on the toe keep looking up stretch your hands at shoulder and slowly come back and hands okay then the one more variation is the hasta pad asan so hasta pad asan slowly take your hands up arch back and exhale bend forward all the way and touch your toes feel the weight on the toes perfect stretch your hands in front slowly hold your head between hands and come up one more round exhale go down if you go back you have to continue okay very slowly bend forward all the way down touch the toe feel the weight on the toes and stay there today we are focusing on the hasta pad angushtasan and variations okay stretch your hands and slowly come back yes and hands down comfortable distance now there is a one more hasta pad angushtasan so where we go down and then we hold the toes and then we square the elbows and we go down okay so first you place the hands on your waist from waist you bend forward 
perfect okay now there you just lower your hands down stretch your body just feel the weight on the toes now hold your toes that's better now square your elbows excellent and feel the weight on the toes and stay there relax your body keep pulling good take the head in the center slowly release your toes and come up adjust your distance for the counter pose it's a intense forward bend so we'll have to give the counter pose slowly bend forward come back to the center one more round slowly take a comfortable distance hands on your and slowly bend forward relax your body hold your toes and slowly feel it that's it shift the weight on the toes keep pulling it is excellent hamstring opening at the same time your lower back release and slowly come up adjust the distance and backward bend Catch your breath. Two foot muscle. Now we'll do Baddha Padma. Yes. Yes. Okay. You need a help? Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. So bend forward all the way down. Keep bending. That's it. So this variation is also again Baddha Padma is the Hasta Pad Angushta. Come up. Release your toes first and relax. So how to do this? So first you'll have to do warm up. So take the legs in front. Now do Ardha Padma with one leg. One leg Ardha Padma. Yes. Now take the hand on the back and hold. Perfect. Now stretch your other hand and hold that toe and bend forward. So is it Hastavada Mushtasan? or not yes so for the variations you can keep adding <clears throat> release release and <clears throat> okay other side <clears throat> good hold it stretch your arm and release your right toe first come up release the left and relax we repeat the same thing from the sideways so they will come to know what we are doing so first what we do for those who are not able to do Baddha Padma, okay, so we'll do with Ardha. So keep one leg relaxed, so one hamstring is not engaged. Here you can easily hold the opposite toe. Once you get the hold of the toe, stretch it and bend forward. Perfect. So in this, we are holding the toe at the same time you are bending forward so it's an abdominal compression and again it's working on your hamstring one hamstring is opening so release your left toe first take the hand up release your right toe and change the side
Padma, Ardha, then we do Arbadha and slowly bend forward. Release your right toe, stretch your arm in front, left toe, relax. Face in front. Now do Padmasana. Excellent. Now your pose will be easily. Yeah. So that's the important thing that where you keep the toe in Padmasana, where the so now it will happen. So now the immediately the position of the toes has changed because of the warm up. And it's just a coordination. This is a matter of fact. Hold it tight and then first come in the center first. Keep holding. Good. That's better. Okay. Now bend forward all the way down. Keep holding. No cheating. Slowly come up and release and relax. Okay. Good. Open. Take the legs in front. <clears throat> Again, face sideways. <clears throat> yeah. So, we did Hasta Padasan, Pada Hastasan. Little bit go back. So, <clears throat> so if you do Pashimottanasan with holding the toes, what will happen? Hasta Pada. Okay. So, stretch your arms. Slowly turn the toes in. Bend forward. Hold your toes. Keep looking up and bend forward. So these are variations. So one day you can keep practicing only all these asanas, like Hastapa Dangusta Asana and variation. Keep looking up, feel the stretch. Good. Release and relax. Counter pose. Release. Cross the legs. No, straight. Yes. Bend forward and hold the toes. Now you'll feel which pressure on the which leg more. Upper or lower? Which? Pull. Upper. Then you'll have to keep the pressing knee on the knee which is down. Then only you get the nice pressure on the upper. Release. Change the position of the leg. Stretch it. Release. And give counter pose. Purvottanasana. <clears throat> Release. Now all we'll do, we'll bend forward and we'll hold the opposite toes. So take a comfortable distance. Yes. And what we do after that, holding opposite toe, we try to twist. Yeah, that's it. Good, good, keep twisting, okay? Again, it's a Parivartit Hastapada Angushtasana or Pada Hastasana. Twist, 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 good. Release. Come up. Change the hand position so it will be other side. Yes. And put the head in and twist okay so this we do the standing variation okay so it's a sitting release up and relax take a little bit more distance i think you'll be more comfortable here okay bend forward hold your opposite toes yes and twist. Excellent. So all the variations of Hastapa Dangushtasana. Release and change. So 
so the hand which is down you'll have to put the head on that side okay so you get the nice twist release and relax okay relax fit together <coughs> now fold your right leg you can face that side so we'll do the hastapada angustasana sitting variation so fold the right leg hold the toe and take the toe up in the air good bring it down release lift now here what is important the position of the knee as you keep the knee closer the toe gap goes up in the air perfect hold it and back okay right leg in hold the toe go for side variation excellent good fold it bring it down stretch side bring it down and sit in bhadrasan so when we what we do in bhadrasan we hold the toes so what is it hastapad bend forward so the series we have we just keep changing the name asanas are the same keep looking up ha uh, today we are not taking the hand in front because it is hastapad it is hastapad good take the right leg out no all the way out yes sideways okay now just bend in front first just bend it's a warm up for your stretches good <clears throat> come back now with your left palm hold your right toe right hand on the back hastapad and bend forward release now same right palm right toe drop the shoulder in front take the left hand up in the air and hold it excellent so you're holding your toe with both the palms what is it hastapad slowly release and change the side Now here it depends upon the flexibility you just don't force yourself the angle of the leg first bend forward this forward bend is a your hip opening come up right palm left toe left hand on the back and relax Try to practice. Breathe normal. Slowly come back. Left hand, left toe, left shoulder in front of the left knee. Right hand up in the air and hold it. Good.
release now take both the legs out both the legs out <coughs> okay good now right palm left toe right palm left toe side yeah yes no first we do the uh, that's it okay good right palm left toe writing hand come up now illiterate hand right toe <laughs> literate hand and illiterate we'll keep it that way okay so this is the palm which don't know how to write so it is illiterate so right good come back relax now literate palm right to excellent and take the hand up and drop it the same variation we did it with the legs out perfect keep twisting perfect release now illiterate palm left to drop the shoulder in front good release now first put your palms on the floor in front now slowly start going down very slowly 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 excellent now take the hands by side and try to hold your toes perfect it is there yes keep looking up breathe normal excellent as you establish in the asan your asan gets more comfortable it's a very very effective very relaxing posture it's a excellent hip opener slowly release your toes take the hands in front first stay there for a while and slowly come back perfect okay so there is one more asan in this in the air that is called merudandasan so it is again the variation of hastapad angushtasan perfect good the same thing we were in the floor it is in the air Okay, so have you missed any Hastapad Angustasan variation? Lying down. Lying down. Okay, so turn to the side, lie down. <clears throat> Now the proper Hastapad Angustasan lying down series we have. So first we'll give the nice stretch, feet together. So Yashtik Asan, arms up, point your toes out. <clears throat> Feel the stretch. We have five variations of Hastapad Angustasan lying down. So first is feet together, one one hand. So slowly lift your right arm up in the air, right leg up, hold the toe, and stay there. First, make sure you are holding the toe. Once you get the hold of the toe, now slowly keep pulling your toe down. Slowly inhaling, leg comes down. Exhale, hand. Inhale, hand up. Exhale, leg up. Hold the toe. Stay there. Once you get the hold, 
start pulling it down. Inhaling, leg will come down. Exhale, hand. We repeat one more round. Feet together. Right hand up. Right leg up. Hold the toe. Keep pulling down now. Start pulling it down. That's it. Good. Inhaling, leg come down. Exhale, hand. Left hand. Left leg. <clears throat> Hold the toe. Pull it. Perfect. Inhale, leg goes down. Exhale, hand. Okay. Second variation. Both the arms up, first both the arms up and both the legs up and hold the toe. Good. In this variation, you can improve your Hastabad Angushtasana since you are lying down. There is no struggle for the balancing. So you can, those who are not able to hold the toe, you can put the belt or handkerchief or towel, anything and just keep holding. Stay there for longer. Let the body open and your asana will be improved. Inhaling, leg comes down. Exhaling, hand. Now here we can do the side split. Okay. So inhale, arms up in the air. Exhale, legs up in the air. Hold the toes and slowly take the legs down sideways. Perfect. Keep holding. Again, this, will, this is an excellent hip opener. Okay, it will improve your splits because you are lying down, you can stay there for longer. Up, legs in the air first, then leg comes down and hands. Okay, third variation is a sliding. So keep the hands by side in the T position, put the palm facing on the floor, fingers together, thumb in. Good right toe towards your right arm and hold now in this you can keep pulling your leg up as high as you can excellent good back other side Good. So what is important that this, you have to lock the leg, then only you can pull. Otherwise, what will happen? The other leg shifts to the side, then the stretch is not, okay? And head is in the center. Release. Try one more round on your own. Good. That ideal position, the heel should be on the path. That's now you get it. Now pull it. <clears throat> Release. Lift. Perfect. Release. Now the fourth variation is cross. So hands at shoulder, feet together, right leg up, place it on your left side and turn your head on the opposite side. And the final position then that's better. The leg which is on the floor should pull in. Right leg up in the air. Bring it down, left up, place it on your right side. Once you get the hold of your toe, turn the hair on the left side. Then you'll have to pull the leg which is on the floor in. Good. 
lift leg up in the air bring the leg down one more round okay right leg up place it on your left side turn your head on the right side bring the left leg in leg up in there right leg up in there bring it down left leg up in the air plus it on your right side turn the head on the left and bring the right leg in right leg up sorry left leg up in the air bring it down excellent now the last variation it is lying down in drudasan <clears throat> So make sure your body is in a straight line. Arm up in the air, leg up in the air. Hold the toe and pull it down. If you want to make it intense, you can lift the head and try to touch your forehead to the knee. Put the head on the floor. release the toe bring it down and down try one more round the same side and then we'll go to the other side arm up in the air leg up hold the toe lift your head try to touch your forehead or chin to your knee excellent put the head down release your toe bring the leg down hand down and we change the side the body should be in a straight line good arm up in the air leg up hold the toe pull it down lift your head try to touch your forehead or chin release your head release your toe and slowly that's why you need the angle is very important okay one more round arm up leg up hold the toe bring it down that's better now now it's better good drop the head down and slowly leg and get ready for shavasana <clears throat> most difficult asan those who are not comfortable in shavasana can lie down in uh, makrasan drudasan supta bhadrasan matsya kridasana all the variations are there for relaxing postures the body should be relaxed then only you can relax your mind next few minutes there is no movement of the body make sure your body is absolutely relaxed especially head neck shoulders ready we we'll start with our toes i relax my toes my toes are relaxed i relax my ankle my ankles are relaxed I relax my curves My curves are relaxed I relax my knees 
my knees up, rely. I relax my tongue, my tongue I relax my groin, my groin is relaxed. I relax my my abdomen my abdomen is relaxed I relax my chest my chest I relax my shoulders, my shoulders are relaxed. I relax my neck, my neck is. I relax my chin, my chin is relaxed. I relax my lips, my lips. I relax my nose, my nose relax. I relax my my forehead my forehead is relaxed I relax my skull my skull is My whole body is relaxed. I am relaxed. I am relaxed.
very slowly move your fingers move your toes bring your feet together very slowly turn to your side very slowly taking support of your hands certain sukhasan very slowly open your eyes when the session here hari om tat sat jay gurudev Take care. Thank you very much.